A workshop and activities for children during the June holidays are seeing even more demand after going online. But some firms that find it tough to make that switch and are losing up to 80% of their usual business. Lisha Rodney finds out more. I'm here at Lazarus Island to join a group of students who are here on a fishing course for beginners this June holidays. Now these students as young as five years old are accompanied by their parents. Together they will learn the basic ropes of fishing, like how to use a fishing rod and reel and how to handle a fish once it's caught. Hands-on programs like this can't simply go online when hit by fresh pandemic restrictions. So when these were relaxed last week, some decided it was high time to get some fresh air. For the past two weeks or so, they have been indoors and it's quite bored for them to stay indoors all the time. Usually, previous years, we will bring them on overseas trip, but we can't go now. So this is the furthest we can get. <laughs> yeah. Sign-ups at My Fishing Frenzy Academy are still down nearly 80 percent, despite being allowed to take in kids during the school holidays. Current rules let up to five students each time, which is still four times less than the firm's usual crowd before the pandemic. When we see that uh, the take-up rate is too low, then we have to postpone the class and try to combine uh, smaller groups. So I think a lot of the parents are still quite cautious about uh, uh, coming out, you know, to attend courses like this. 